Thanks again for tuning in. My name is Matt Wayman. I'm an attorney with the Hammer Law Firm. Today we're chatting about how to find your criminal court cases in the state of Missouri. The biggest database is going to be CaseNet. It's located through courts.missouri.gov. Once you're at the database, you just the first thing we're going to do is search by litigant search name. You can also search by filing date if you'd like. Case number search is very helpful. Uh, some of these other things aren't as helpful. Really where you're going to be living is case number search and litigant name search. Today, for the purpose of demonstration, we will look at litigant name search. The first thing we're going to want to do is look at uh, criminal cases. You can also search civil, family, domestic. That would be orders of protection and family court cases. Uh, we have another video talking about traffic and municipal cases as well, so check that out. Uh, we're just going to search uh, for criminal court cases. It's going to type in a filler name. So we're going to go with Tim Smith. We're then going to hit find. This is going to search for cases in every jurisdiction. So you can click under jurisdictions and find every different circuit. If we were looking at, for instance, St. Louis County specifically, we could click on St. Louis County. This would actually allow us to narrow the search a little bit by searching for pending cases and also disposed of cases. Uh, but we're just going to search all of the state of Missouri, which is every jurisdiction that has records that go into case nets. So we're just going to hit find. This is going to return um, quite a few records, which you can tell because it's processing for so long. I guess while it's doing that, I'll just address the issue in the room. Uh, I am an attorney. I know I'd like 13. Uh, it was a real Doogie Hauser type situation. Uh, so just have some respect, okay? So now it came back. It's got 422 entries. That's quite a few. So we can look at a, up to 100 of them, which isn't going to be too helpful because there's 400. So we want to narrow our search a little bit. So we could just look for Tim Lee Smith. So we would just click back. We would type in middle name Lee. And then we would be able to uh, narrow our search to find specific records just for Tim Lee Smith. Now there's just eight records, so it makes it really easy for us to find records for just Tim Lee Smith. That's just a brief overview on how to uh, navigate finding criminal cases in the state of Missouri using CaseNet. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Tune back in soon for more videos.